Okay, what's up people? So as you can see from the title, today we're gonna do a denim DIY distressed, I don't know what I'm gonna call it yet, but something along those lines. And my inspiration was from this picture. I don't know if it's gonna be mean or not. Okay, um, it's from this picture, Shop Akira is a website. And basically I had this denim dress Okay, let me go back and zoom in. Basically, I had this denim dress and I thought it was pretty boring. And then I was like, well, hello, like denim distress is so in right now. So why not do it? And so I distressed it. You can only see a little bit, but I'm going to insert some clips. So if you want to see how I got this looking from just a normal plain dress to this cute, trendy denim distress whatever <laughs> then just keep on watching okay basically you're first gonna want to start off by putting a piece of cardboard or whatever you have inside the clothing and basically this is just gonna prevent you from cutting into the other side then you're gonna get your exacto knife you can get these anywhere actually I think I got this at the Dollar General and I think it literally cost me like a dollar or whatever well, no shit, duh. But anyways. And as you see me doing here, I'm just cutting straight lines. And basically, this is where we're going to distress it. And if you want it more distressed, obviously cut more lines. If you don't, then cut less. Okay, and afterwards, you're just going to get your tweezers. And you're just going to start pulling at the thread. At first, the white threads are going to come out. But eventually, the blue threads will stick out. And those are the ones you want to take off so you can get that distressed look and it's just not going to be a big hole and you basically just want to keep distressing until you like it Okay, here we go. Okay, you see how she has the big holes around the shoulders and all the distress on the arms? That's what we're going to try to achieve next. So, I'm just going to like eyeball it and cut on the shoulders and hopefully it'll look good. So, let's do this. Um, now we're gonna try it on because hopefully I like how this looks or else it's gonna suck. Mm. Okay, I actually like how the little cut came out because it didn't come out too big or too small. So now we're just gonna distress it. Alright. Okay, and after you cut the holes on the shoulders, Basically, it's just the same process. You're just gonna keep plucking at the thread and then I use I do end up using some um, What is it called? Oh, I end up using a razor to just kind of make it faster and don't be like me use like a clean razor Mine was like old and rusty, but what is? <laughs> 
And then afterwards, after you're finished with that, you're just going to go to the sleeves and you're just basically going to cut straight lines all throughout. Obviously, the more you, the more distressed you want it, the more lines you're going to cut. And I think I did three or four and I liked how it came out. Yeah, that's a lot of denim and then my dog obviously decides to sit down when I'm sweeping the floor. But look how cute he looks. Look how cute my baby looks. Oh he's so cute man. He's so cute. Go to sleep. Alright, tell them bye, Lenny. Okay, and after you're done all with that, you're just gonna keep distressing. And you're gonna keep distressing until you kind of get something like this and eventually like that. But thank you so much if you watched this far. Please subscribe if you like these videos. It helps a lot and it both motivates me a lot. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.